So when we have an injury that may have affected the extensors to the thumb, we have a couple of tests that we need to do in order to test for three uh, tendons. The first one is extensor pollicis longus, and we ask the patient to raise their thumb off the table. So if you just say, can you lift your thumb, thumb here? Uh, and here you can see the tendon of the extensor pollicis longus standing out. The other movement that we need to ask them to do is to move their thumb away from the hand. So you can do it and ask them to copy you. And you can still see the extensor pollicis longus tendon, but around the corner here, you can see the extensor pollicis brevis. And if you palpate it, you can feel there are actually two tendons there, the other one being the abductor pollicis longus. So in summary, we ask the patient to lift their thumb from the table to test the extensor pollicis longus and take the thumb out to the side to test extensor pollicis brevis and abductor pollicis longus.